Hi guys, um, today I'm going to show you how to use an EpiPen epinephrine auto injector. Um, an EpiPen basically is a uh, is an injector shot used to uh, administer medication to a person who is having an allergic reaction or is in anaphylactic shock due to coming in contact with something they're allergic to. So um, your normal EpiPen, this is a double pack, there's two of them. I'm just going to use this one for the demonstration. Uh, will look like this. Whoops. And um, you see, you get your plastic tubing here, and you get a yellow cap. This just holds it until you need to use it. Um, okay. So to get the EpiPen out of the casing, you're just gonna take it and slide it out. Okay. So this is what it looks like. It's got um, yellow writing, yellow writing on it. You can see it there, and you can actually see the medication inside if you turn it around. Epinephrine is just a fancy word for um, for adrenaline, it'll provide extra adrenaline during a reaction or during anaphylactic shock. So this is where I'm going to put this away because it actually has the medication in it. And knock on wood, I'll never have to use it, but, you know, it's better to be safe than sorry. So I'm going to take out the trainer now. This doesn't have any medication or a needle in it, and it's uh, you can demonstrate with it and train people this is what's used. So I'm going to start the demonstration right now. So you see my thigh right here. What you're going to want to do is take it with your strong hand. You're going to grip it, take off the gray safety cap, and this will unlock the device so it's easier to use. And with force, press it into the person's thigh and hold it for 10 seconds. You have to really do this with force because sometimes it might not come out if you don't do it hard enough. So then when you're done, you're going to pull it out and call 911 as soon as you can. Get to a phone and call 911. Alright, so that's how to use an EpiPen. Um, I hope you'll never actually have to use one because it's a scary experience. But if you do, you feel good about it and you know that you saved someone's life. So, thanks and stay safe.